Hi, guys. While the DocuSign app holds about 70% of the e-signature market, other DocuSign alternatives continue to actively penetrate the market. Using electronic signature apps means eliminating the pains typically associated with paper-based signing. Maybe you're looking for a DocuSign alternative that's more affordable or easier to use. Either way, we've got you covered. There are some excellent DocuSign alternatives on the market. To help you find one, we've listed some of the best DocuSign alternatives. But at the end of the day, there's no single alternative to DocuSign that is best for everyone. Every e-signature tool has its own magic and suits the needs of different people. Watch on to learn more about these providers and find out which one will work best for your needs. So let's get started. The first one on the list is Pandadoc. Pandadoc is a document platform designed to handle everything from electronic signatures to document management. Pandadoc specializes in sales documentation. The app simplifies sending, tracking, and signing sales forms and contracts. Pandadoc comes equipped with a unique document editor to help you create business documents from scratch and automate the entire process. The platform also offers templates to help you jumpstart your document library. When you use Pandadoc, you can create time-saving proposals, quotes, and sales contracts from pre-made templates. You can also pull customer data from your current CRM platform to further ease the process. Pandadoc integrates seamlessly with software such as Salesforce, HubSpot, Zoho, PayPal, and Stripe. And for the pricing, Pandadoc's Essentials Plan is $19 per user per month with annual billing. This plan includes all the standard features plus templates and a drag and drop document editor. The business plan is $49 per user per month and includes a content library, custom branding, and approval workflows. A custom enterprise option is also available. A free plan is also available. Quick note, my work is supported by affiliate commissions, so if this video is helpful, you can find links to my electronic signature apps, one mention, in the video description. If you click those links, I may earn a commission. That helps a lot. Thank you. Okay, next, let's talk about SignNow. SignNow software is made to scale with your workflow and is part of the Airstate Business Cloud. SignNow features the ability to approve, deliver, and sign documents from any device in any location. It has reusable templates for your most common business processes and offers the ability to add branding to every e-signature invitation you send. SignNow is designed to give you more from e-signatures by allowing you to generate documents, negotiate contracts, accept payments, and create automated workflows from a single platform. SignNow is primarily known as a robust web app that allows for signing documents from anywhere, anytime. It also features fully functional iOS and Android apps, allowing users to edit, collaborate on, and e-sign documents even when offline. Along with many other features, SignNow mobile apps enable you to text message signatures, import files from a photo library, capture documents using your phone's camera, and even collect in-person signatures with your iPad in kiosk mode. And for the pricing, SignNow's business plan costs $8 per user per month with annual billing. With this plan, you can still send unlimited documents for signing. There's also a business premium plan for $15 per user per month and an enterprise plan for $30 per user per month, both with annual billing. You can purchase any plan for up to 10 users online. If you need more than 10 users, contact Sign now. Next, we have Dropbox Sign. Dropbox Sign, formerly Hello Sign, is a simple and straightforward way to capture legally binding e-signatures. As with many services like DocuSign, Dropbox Sign integrates seamlessly with Dropbox, as well as Google and other major platforms, to create a signature solution that is simple and easy to use. Dropbox Sign offers templates and custom branding solutions, as well as team management tools for its enterprise plans. However, Dropbox Sign doesn't offer a document editor or any kind of robust document creation tool. Using plugin tools, you can connect Dropbox Sign to Google Docs so that the tools are available to you while creating your documents. As a DocuSign alternative, Dropbox Sign wins points for ease of use and seamless Google Docs integration. This electronic signature software is unobtrusive and does a great job of staying out of the way so that you can streamline your signing process. 
Continue using the tools you've already used and use Dropbox Sign to insert signatures into live documents, including PDFs, whenever and wherever you need them. And for the pricing, Dropbox Sign plans start at $15 per month for a single user when paid annually. The entry-level plan lets you send, sign and collect signatures and your signers have the ability to pre-populate fields. Next, we have Adobe Acrobat Sign. As part of the Adobe family of apps, you can expect Adobe Sign to work well with most other business-related apps you'll see on the market today. Adobe Sign uses an online cloud-based system to sign and send documents, like many of the other apps on our list. With Adobe Sign, you'll be able to capture legal e-signatures and create reliable audit trails. You can also collect payment via credit card, use custom branding, and share document templates on higher tiered plans. And Adobe Sign does provide a variety of support options, though several of these are locked behind cost as well. On top of that, you'll also have access to integrations, APIs, and advanced fields for a price. However, compared to DocuSign, Adobe Sign can be a game changer. There are a few drawbacks to Adobe Sign. While Adobe will help you capture legally binding e-signatures, they point out that the level of e-signature compliance varies based on the plan you get. While this won't be an issue for most signers, it's worth checking into if you have specific legal requirements surrounding the digital signatures you need to acquire. And for the pricing. Single user Acrobat sign plans begin at $12.99 per month, with the option to pay either monthly or annually. There's also a pro option at $19.99 per month. Team plans start at $14.99 per month per license. Acrobat Sign assures users that they'll never have to deal with hidden fees or rising costs. Then we have DocHub. Speaking of free DocuSign alternatives, DocHub is essentially an online PDF editor with e-signature functionality under the hood. Reasonable pricing makes it attractive to individuals and small businesses that don't have massive document turnover. DocHub comes with all the standard functionalities. It allows users to annotate documents, white out text, append pages, merge files, add fields, and more. Services like Gmail, Google Drive, and Dropbox are seamlessly integrated into DocHub. DocHub has a free plan and offers a free 30-day trial period for the pro plan. And for the pricing, a free plan is available, $0 per user per month, and you get 2,000 documents and 5 e-signatures per month. The Pro Plan, $10 a month if billed annually, and you get unlimited documents and e-signatures. As you can see, DocuSign isn't the only great app out there. There are plenty of others, even beyond what we've listed here today. Some have features similar to DocuSign, others have a completely different set of features and functions. The point of this video isn't to force you to use something other than DocuSign, it's to consider the other options out there. For some companies, sticking with what's familiar might be worth it, but for others, switching to a new alternative with tools that better suit their needs and goals can help them build their business presence faster. Whichever tool you choose, we'd recommend trying the free version first, risk-free, and if you like it more, you can upgrade. So yeah, that's it for this video. Like I said earlier, my work is supported by affiliate commissions, so if this video was helpful, you can check the links in the description. Again, that helps a lot, so thank you. And hopefully this video will help you out. If it did, please leave a comment and click the like button, that helps too. And goodbye for now.